Seven people hospitalized after a hazmat situation at a public pool complex in Mesa. It happened at the Brim Hall Aquatics Complex. Mesa says that five city employees and two people who were in swim lessons, they all needed treatment. The nearby Franklin Accelerated Academy at Brim Hall was also evacuated. About 28 children were on campus for summer school. It's unclear what kind of chemicals caused the problem at the pool. The city says it has a lot of safety protocols when handling the chemicals and they are looking now into what went wrong. Seven people hospitalized today after a hazmat situation at a public pool in Mesa. This happened at the Brimhall Aquatics Complex near Southern and Higley. Mesa Fire says five city employees and two participants in swim lessons needed treatment. The nearby Franklin Accelerated Academy at Brimhall was evacuated and 28 students were on campus for summer school. It's unclear what exact chemicals caused the problem at the pool. The city says it has extensive safety protocols when handling the chemicals and they're looking into what went wrong. Firefighters rescue chemical spill at a Mesa City pool sent seven people to the hospital. The city says it happened around 7:30 this morning. The Brimhall Aquatics Complex was evacuated, and a hazmat disposal company was brought in to clean everything up. The city says paramedics took five city employees and two people who were at the complex to local hospitals. Investigators are working to learn how the spill happened. And we'll stay on this one, Faye. Thank you. A valley pool will remain closed tomorrow following a hazmat situation involving pool chemicals. It happened this morning near Higley and Southern. We're told seven people were taken to the hospital with respiratory issues. A neighboring summer school was canceled for the day. City of Mesa said it's unclear exactly what kind of chemicals caused this harmful hazmat situation. Anytime you're dealing with with chemicals and you're crossing mixtures or anything like that, there could be a reaction. So just keeping that in mind, we have, we're right in the peak of heading into pool season. Well, the rest of the Brim Hall campus will reopen tomorrow. However, the dive-in movie night that was scheduled for tomorrow at the pool has been postponed until next Friday. Several high information now on a hazmat situation involving pool cleaning chemicals sent several people to the hospital this morning in Mesa near Higley and Southern. Officials are working to determine exactly what happened with those chemicals, but it closed the pool in neighboring summer school. ABC 15's Jordan Bonke is working for you on what you should know about using and storing common pool chemicals. It wasn't just Valley Police and Fire Departments responding to the hazmat situation at Brimhall Aquatic Complex Thursday morning in Mesa. But eventually, the Arizona Department of Environmental Quality and a hazmat disposal company even showed up. This all happened around 7.30 after officials say more than 10 people needed medical attention for a hazmat situation involving pool chemicals. Marissa Ramirez-Ramos is with Mesa Fire and Medical. Most of them were having respiratory type of re you know, reaction. Seven people were taken to the hospital. Five of them were Mesa Parks and Rec employees. The other two were there for a scheduled swim lesson. Mesa Public Schools tells ABC 15 summer school buses were headed to the neighboring school when they were rerouted to a different campus and classes were ultimately canceled for the day. The city of Mesa said it's unclear exactly what kind of chemicals caused the harmful hazmat situation, but in a statement they said that they're evaluating their processes to ensure the continued safety of the public. Anytime you're dealing with with chemicals and you're crossing mixtures or anything like that, there could be a reaction. So just keeping that in mind, we have, we're right in the peak of heading into pool season. A situation like this led us to get some perspective on the common chemicals used in pools. If you mix chlorine with anything, you're asking for trouble. This is Phoenix pool expert DJ Pritchard with AOK -OK Pool Services. He says when using chlorine, do so away from your body and in a well-ventilated space. If not handled properly or inhaled, it could cause rust respiratory, vision, and digestive issues. And if mixed... Chlorine uh, gas is, was used in World War I as mustard gas, and so it's the same kind of thing. You can create that in your backyard if you're not careful. Another common chemical is muriatic acid, used to help reduce pH levels and prevent cloudiness in pools. Pritchard says read the bottle before using and try to use them at separate times. If I'm going to add two, uh, two different chemicals, I go to different sides of the pool. Jordan Bonke, ABC 15, Arizona. Jordan, thank you. Seven people, including two children, are hospitalized after a hazmat situation that happened at a public pool in Mesa. It happened this morning at the Brimhall Aquatic Complex near Higley and Southern. 
The other five people were taken to the hospital. They were city employees. It's not clear exactly what chemicals caused that problem at the pool. A nearby school had to be evacuated, though, in response to all of this. A hazmat disposal company was called to clean up that site. Some areas in Coconino County. In Mesa, officials say that the pool at Brim Hall Aquatic Complex will be closed tomorrow as they are continuing to clean up after a hazmat issue today. The issue this morning led to five city employees and two people who were in swim lessons to be taken to the hospital. It's unclear what chemicals caused the problem in the pool. Officials say that the rest of the Brim Hall campus will be open tomorrow, just not the pool. Several communities. A chemical spill at a city of Mesa pool sent seven people to the hospital. The city says this happened around 7:30 this morning. The Brim Hall Aquatics Complex was evacuated, and a hazmat disposal company was brought in to clean things up. The city says paramedics treated five city employees and two people who were at the complex. They were all taken to local hospitals. Investigators are still working to learn how that spill happened. Mix chlorine with anything, you're asking for trouble. This morning, ABC 15 is learning a pool in Mesa will stay closed after a hazmat situation sent several people to the hospital. It all happened Thursday afternoon at the Brim Hall Aquatic Center near Higley and Southern. City officials telling us the hazmat situation was caused by a mixture of pool chemicals. Right now, we're working to figure out what exactly happened here. ABC 15 checking in with the Valley Pool Expert who says when you're using chlorine, do it away from your body and especially in a well-ventilated space. Great advice there. 508 story we first shared as an ABC 15 breaking news push alert yesterday. Maybe you got this on your cell phone. Well, today the Brim Hall Aquatic Center in Mesa is closed. Our team's confirming with Mesa fire crews that seven people, including two children, went to the hospital after a hazmat situation involving a mixture of baking soda and bleach. We're told the two kids were taking part in swim classes. The other five people involved were City of Mesa employees. We've asked firefighters how they are doing this morning, and it is important to know that situations like this can dangerously, they can turn dangerous very quickly at your house too, even if you're dealing with just common chemicals. So ABC 15 asked a pool maintenance expert what we all need to keep in mind as we do head into pool season. Mix chlorine with anything, you're asking for trouble. Chlorine uh, gas is, was used in World War I as mustard gas, and so it's the same kind of thing. You can create that in your backyard if you're not careful. Okay, so the best rule to follow here, he says, if you need to add two chemicals to the pool, read the back of the bottle first and try to add them at different times. If you can't do that, well, you can add them at different ends of the pool. Okay. Following up now on a story you may have seen as an ABC 15 breaking news push alert to your phone yesterday. Today, we're learning the Brim Hall Aquatic Center in Mesa is now closed. Our team's confirming with Mesa firefighters, seven people, including two kids, went to the hospital after a hazmat situation involving a mixture of baking soda and bleach. We are told the two children were taking part in swim classes. The other five people involved were City of Mesa employees. ABC 15 reaching back out to firefighters to try and find out their condition. But it is important to know situations like this can quickly turn dangerous at your home too, even if you're dealing with common chemicals. So ABC 15 asked a pool maintenance expert what we all need to keep in mind as we head into pool season. Mix chlorine with anything, you're asking for trouble. Chlorine uh, gas is, was used in World War I as mustard gas, and so it's the same kind of thing. You can create that in your backyard if you're not careful. The best rule to follow here, if you need to add two chemicals to the pool, read the back of the bottle first and try to add them at different times. If you can't do that, you can add them at different ends of the pool.